<laughs> okay. Now you should be able to see see that uh, thing pretty good there. I'm going to drop that down just a little bit more so you can see it. Okay, and, sh and I'm just going to show you how I, I take care of that. Okay, um, get enough material out on that. And I start in the center and I work my way out, okay? Be afraid to add some more flux, guys, as you go along, okay? You cannot put too much of this material on here, okay? And it's going to just help with the uh, wicking around. Okay, now, make sure you inspect all that. Make sure every one of those things are, are worked up. See this corner right here? You can see it. It's worked up. I'm happy with that. Okay, now, double check that you're, that you're nice and tight, okay? And then now I'm going to go around the perimeter of this. I'm going to pick this up. But before I do, I'm going to come in here and clean this with some more flux, okay? Flux is your friend, guys. Don't be afraid to use it. Okay. Over here, keep the outside. See that dropping in. Okay. I'm gonna put this other glove on because I need to use it to move it. I'm just going to get it. Working my way around it. Before I move that, what I'll do is I'll let that set a, a minute and, uh, and cool down a little bit and set up. And blow on it a little bit, clean it up. Once you, start, once you see it start to gray out a little bit, you can go ahead and turn it over. Okay. Now I want to come in here and get this edge right here. Go ahead and clean that up again. Again, okay. And this is pretty hot, so all you got to do is basically just just touch it and. Okay. 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 Just drop right in.
okay? Come back around here with this. Knock off all that excess. Clean it up. Okay? And that is basically how that section is done, okay? Now, if you look inside there, see if I can get a little closer here. Maybe you can see a little better like that. Looks like that's a better view. It's hard to see because it got you up so high. Uh, come inside here. Get your material in this, okay? Nice and, nice and cleaned out, okay? Start hitting the inside of that, okay? Go from the outside. that portion of it okay so now you just lock you just locked in that um, that uh, component to where what once I drill my holes out here water will be able to go inside and surround all those pipes and cool those pipes off so when that ethanol goes through there it's actually condensed and drops back down to stack those or, or load those plates okay so uh, that's how we, we do that I'm gonna let that cool for a second I'm gonna drop it in some water and then I'm going to flip it over. I'm going to go ahead and put that second um, ferrule on there. And then that'll finish up, you know, the, the hard stuff. And the rest is, is, is fairly easy. But um, I'll show you how we go about doing that, okay? All right. All right, now that I got, the, uh, I got that cooled off, I'm, I, I went ahead and put that other uh, brass uh, ferrule on there. I'm going to go ahead and heat this thing up and uh, get that thing done but that's that's basically what the inside looks like and it looks nice and clean I, I don't know if you can see that or not but uh very nice holds water or does not hold water um and, and we'll clean all that up in a little bit okay but uh anyway let's go ahead and solder this on i'll show you how we get that done Shoulders nice and square. All that excess bullshit off. Alright, so that takes care of that. Let that cool down a little bit. I'll drop it in some water and then we'll go into uh, getting some of this other stuff done as far as getting some of the. Uh, some of the um, 
female adapters uh, put on there for our, uh, for our thermoport and for our, um, for our jackets, for our water jacket inlet and uh, exhaust, okay? So uh, bear with me and we'll get that taken care of. Okay. All right, guys, now that I got everything cooled off and everything, I want to show you, um, you know, the, the shoulders, okay? The shoulder right here is nice and square, but I've got a lot, of, a lot of material up here, and I want to get rid of that. I don't like all that. And typically how I do that is I'll bring it over to my, uh, my uh, blade sander um, and, just, and just run that thing on the edge. I do not put this thing square on there. I, I put it at an angle a little bit, and I'm kind of overemphasizing this just so you can see. But... Um, you don't want to put it square because if you put it square, what it's going to do, it's going to put a notch in this body section and it is a pain in the butt to get out. Um, so just, just keep that in mind when you're doing that so you don't, so you don't scar your body. Um, and just, just take it easy and, and you'll be able to clean all that off of there, okay? I'm going to show you how we do that. If you look at that now, you don't see any of that garbage on there anymore, and, and it really looks clean, okay? Now, I'm going to show you what I do now, so you have this discoloration. I'll take this over to the, uh, to the grinding wheel again, or to the uh, buffer, and I'll use that, um, that wire wheel again, and I will come from here all the way to here and just run it and, 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 and work it all the way around. It'll clean this thing right up. It'll take care of all these little scars and everything. Um, so just bear with me, and I'll show you how that looks, okay? Okay, excuse me, all right, eye protection guys, do not do not forget to wear your eye protection on this thing, I, can't, I cannot reiterate that enough, um, this, this wire brush, it's, it spews stuff off of there when you're, when you're running it, okay, and you can feel it hitting your, hitting your uh, shield, so make sure you wear that, okay, so here we go, come around here, See that? See how clean that looks? Nice and clean. Now I'm going to take it over to the buffer and I'm going to go ahead and buff it. Okay? And that'll, and that'll clean it up even more. So I'll show you how that goes.